Hello everyone, this is Lakshman. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. In today's session, I am sharing what is a scalability, a maintainability, a readability and a reusability. So these are the terms uh, frequently used in IT projects. So many freshers or uh, some beginners, they may have no idea about uh, what exactly these meanings. So that is the reason I am uploading these uh, terminologies. So first uh, let me discuss about uh, what is scalability. Scalability means the capacity of software to manage more users or data or events. Suppose if you have an e-commerce app, whenever 100 users are hitting the Amazon app, so it will give some performance. So at the same time, if 10,000 users are hitting the Amazon app, then the performance should be steady for individual user while the number of users are increases. Okay, so that is nothing but the software should be steady. That is nothing but the performance of the software should be steady while the number of users are increasing also. So that is nothing but a scalability of the application. Scalability is the ability to expand software to handle more volumes of users and high frequency of transactions. Performance and scalability is achieved by the application architecture only, not by any uh, programming language or not by any framework. Okay, please remember that point. And next one is maintainability. Maintainability is nothing but how easy we enhance, support and fix the software which is, which is we created. Maintainability is directly connection with uh, how well designed the application. I will tell you few reasons that the code may not be easy to maintain in the features. The first one is the tightly coupled. If the application is tightly coupled with another system, then it may not be easy to maintain the software in future. And second one, configuration hard code. If you've done configuration with hard code, then it may not be easy to maintain the to maintain the code in the future. Okay. The next one, poor documentation and poor unit testing, it would have low maintainability. So that is the reason maintainability is the important part of important part to develop the project as well. The next one is readability. Readability means that the code is easy to understand. Understanding the code means being able to easy to see inputs and outputs. That means what each line of the code is doing. So another meaning of readability is naming of variables functions or classes while we are declaring the programming. So whenever we are declaring variables, functions or classes in the programming, then those names must be a readable format. That means everyone can easily understand those names. So it saves a lot of time for the programmer. So that is the reason you must declare variables, classes and functions in easy and readable way. Okay. So the next one is reusability so reusability is nothing but you have to write the code with the likely future user cases in mind generally business requirements are rapidly changing or expanding so make sure that that code can be easily be updated to support new kinds of products in the future so you have to write the code in such a way that code can be easily updated in the future based on their business requirements. It's nothing but reusability. The next one is productivity. Productivity is nothing but a progress towards a defined goal by managing resources. Here resources means time, money and energy. Productivity is about doing with the most and least. So it depends on the each person's capability and their circumstances within their control. So productivity is nothing but it, it must be progress towards a defined goal. Okay. So by using your resources, it might be time or energy or uh, money. So that's all guys. If you have any doubts, please comment in the comment section. So if we, 
if you feel really helpful this video please share to your friends also so thank you for watching